Breaking now, a Bel Air police officer killed in a motorcycle crash. The news coming just moments ago. We've been following this story on air and on ClickTreeHouston.com since it happened just hours ago. Good afternoon. I'm Keith Garvin. And I'm Sarah Donchi. This happened on Ferris Drive near Beech Nut in Bel Air. We have team coverage on this story. We want to begin with Robert Arnold, who is live where the crash happened. Robert. Yes, even though this crash involved a Bel Air police officer, it actually happened just inside the city limits of Houston. The officer's motorcycle is still in the front yard of this home. Investigators are taking measurements, pictures, examining that motorcycle, trying to figure out what happened. Since this involved a Bel Air police officer, but inside the city limits of Houston, you'll see both Houston and Bel Air police investigators here trying to figure out exactly what caused this crash. This crash happened just before 2 o'clock, and on the street at that time, there were a lot of workmen out here. We spoke to one of those workmen. He asked us not to show his face, and he spoke in Spanish, but he said he was standing on the street just as the officer passed by. The only thing I know is the officer went by, he put on his lights, he accelerated, and then lost control. He hit a trailer and then went up into the yard. And again, you have investigators from both departments here trying to figure out what exactly preceded that crash. One of the other things that police are looking at right now is possibly whether that officer was responding to reports of a nearby crime. Police say there was a robbery not far from here on Redwick, and they're trying to figure out if maybe that's why the officer turned on his lights and started to accelerate. The officer was rushed to Memorial Hermann Hospital, but as you say, unfortunately, he passed away. Reporting live from Southwest Houston, Robert Arnold, KPRC, Channel 2 News.